Hello, this is going to be a short video on how to flash the uh, twerp recovery, um, the OtterX twerp recovery, um, once you already have the um, OtterX bootloader. Um, and for some reason, um, you, don't, you don't have um, a working twerp or you forgot to flash it. Um, you're going to need a, a few files. Um, you're going to need your ADB files, uh, fast boot. Recommend a MD5 uh, checksum utility, um, and then you're going to need your OtterX uh, twerp. And um, currently, the, the best one is the 2710. Um, and you're going to need the, the image file. Um, that, that can be found in hash codes um, OtterX recovery. Files here on uh, on Goo, and then um, you're also going to need um, your Kindle Fire drivers installed, um, and you can get those from the um, Kindle Fire utility. Uh, just run the uh, install drivers bat. And uh, reboot your PC. If you have Windows 8, you're going to need to um, disable um, driver signature enforcement um, before you install the drivers. Okay, so now I'm going to open a command prompt. Uh, you can find that in uh, all programs, um, accessories, accessories, command prompt. Um, once you open that, I have my files in a folder called ADB on uh, C drive um, just to find that simple way to do that I just, just need to do a change directory CD and uh, your folder name and enter and it'll change the command prompt to point to uh, your, your folder and then um, we're gonna do a, a fast boot command flash you have a space one space between the these commands. Um, recovery. And your file name, which is uh I'm gonna use the uh twerp um, two seven one zero. You can either type it out or copy it and paste it. And then uh you can go ahead and press enter, um, or you can wait and uh, boot your Kindle. I have my Kindle turned off right now. Um, I'm going to go ahead and press uh, enter, and I'll just wait. Um, I'll press the power button until the green light comes on. This is connected to the USB already. Um, once it Text it automatically puts it in fast boot mode, and uh, you can see it says sending, okay, writing, okay. Um, then we just do a, a fast boot reboot, and next time it goes around, we're going to press the power button once and select uh, long press on recovery boot, and uh, it'll boot to. Uh, our uh, twerp recovery. I don't know if it's going to fix the. There we go, 2710. And um, now that you have that, you can uh, push a ROM uh, using your US um, ADB. Um, push commands. Uh, anyways, that's uh, should be all that we need to do for this video. Thanks for watching.